I lied. For I did not want to lie upon the altar. Become the slaughter of my own sin offering. Evading the spirit of mourning. Bleeding. But it was not alarming. Charming my way through lies The maggots in my mouth birthed into flies Others started to despise this Unfamiliar darling Bewitching my sins with the artistry of lies Knees high in what I once derived there's no truth in my eyes Lying holds no prize Of lying were purchased by size I would not have the time This form of witchcraft Is taught like a lie Prime opportunity to tell the truth But I lied For I did not want to lie upon the altar Become the slaughter of my own sin offering Evading the spirit of mourning Bleeding, but it was not alarming Performing as if I had not eaten the apple I heard the serpent chuckle yet I chose to buckle my sins down with leaves of lies Knowing one day my sins would rise Like thorns in my side lying a form of pride Behold the destruction, did not imagine the eruption of confusion. Now I'm an illusion because I lied, for I did not want to lie upon the altar and become the slaughter of my own sin offering, evading the spirit of mourning, bleeding, but it was not alarming. Conforming to my lies, I failed to realize I had incarnated the prophets of Baal, eating at the table of Jezebel. Lies are from hell. Yet this table turned altar was not on fire, for I was a liar. Praying to a God who was not the author of lies. My flesh started to die since the life of the flesh is in the blood and I had been bleeding but it was not alarming farming was never a trait of mine yet I was reaping what I had sowed behold the water in the trench around Elijah's altar representing the spirit of the father since the offering required blood upon the altar Elijah only Elijah only Elijah only bothered to pour the water upon the altar. When the bullock was slaughtered, only, only then could he pray to the Father. Yet I lied, for I did not want to lie upon the altar and become the slaughter of my own sin offering, evading the spirit of mourning, bleeding. But it was not alarming, shredding my once earned truth. What? The sword called tongue of lies I used the wand of tongues to hypnotize Voodoo I sprinkled in my victims eyes It kept them from being wise Lies I served for breakfast, lunch, and dinner My hands became primer in order to hold up my lies Lies don't cry, they lie So I lied for I did not want to lie upon the altar And become the slaughter of my own sin offering Evading the spirit of mourning Bleeding but it was not alarming Calling for mercy to reign over my sins And its lies without a sin offering Until I listened to my victims howling Then I considered my tactic of lying By prime through Leviticus That brought me out the lying mist To hear the scripture crying For the life of the flesh is in the blood And I have given it to you upon the altar to make an atonement for your soul stop 
and trying to control with the artistry of lies it does not make atonement for the soul unfold your hand lay down your cards of lies you recognize that you're bleeding from your side is it not alarming that he bled from his side that elijah shadowed his side blood and water poured from his side why abide by lies it's a snare only prayer beholds the eyes of the father when there are blood and water upon the altar don't falter and line upon the altar only then can the spirit of the water cleanse you from the source that fostered this posture you find this intriguing but why aren't you inquiring the sprinkling of your brother's blood behind the veil it unveils the seat of mercy unlike lying are you thirsty for the spirit of the water can only be poured upon your altar when the blood you shed is secreted upon your altar then will you see fire, but experience mercy. Four. I became a shadow of myself as I hid behind spoken and unspoken lies. With shifty eyes, hands, and feet, I dodged conversation, often detaching myself from myself to avoid admitting deceit. With a basket full of opportunities to tell the truth, I still chose to cling my tongue to dishonesty as I led devoted friends deeper into my forest of lies by creating characters and situations. I lied because I did not want to pay the penalty for my sins. I lied because I had not fully embodied repentance. I lied because I had been fooled into believing that truth held no victory. I lied because I was afraid of the pain that would rise from the innocent. I lied because I feared the destruction of how much truth I would have to tell. Out of the dim light within me, I prayed to my father, asking him to do what I could not, to bring my truth to light. I clenched at the sight of this married man a year later, now willing to remove the veil of our two-month sexual betrayal. I felt frail but liberated, even though he paraded me as the engineer. But this act did engineer the beginning of my journey towards truth-telling. I had been inhaling and secreting lies. There was no surprise that I needed a purifier to cleanse me from my lies. My wise father flushed me with the spirit of the water, removing my toxins.